Today will be one of the three busiest holiday travel days at airports across the country. So you're going to need to brace yourselves because people. According to the TSA, airport holiday travel season starts today and runs through January 2nd. And the three busiest days are today, Friday, December 29th, and Monday, January 1st. TSA is expecting to screen more than two and a half million passengers on every single one of those days. That's a lot of people. And the TSA knows it because it's a 6% increase in people they're screening over last year. Now, things won't be as crazy at the airports as they were during the 12 day Thanksgiving travel season, which by the way, broke records for the most passengers ever screened in a single day. That record happened just a few weeks ago on November 26th when TSA screened 2.9 million passengers at security checkpoints nationwide in one day. So how can you make your airport holiday travel as easy as possible? The TSA is giving 10 suggestions. I'm going to highlight just three of them. The TSA says if you are traveling with gifts, make sure they are unwrapped and they can be inspected if need be. You'd probably hate to put all that effort in wrapping a gift only to have to tear it open in the security line so TSA can check the box. They also suggest when you are packing, make sure you start with an empty bag. That way you don't accidentally pack any banned items like pocket knives or flammable items. Speaking of what you can pack, remember there is a limitation on the amount of liquid you can carry on a plane. Passengers can bring 3.4 ounces or less per container in one quart size clear plastic zip top bag in which all liquids must fit in the bag. There is only one bag per passenger allowed. Now you can obviously bring solid foods like cakes and other baked goods on the plane, but if you are bringing like your famous homemade jam, it will fall into that 3.4 ounce rule. The TSA says if you can spill it, spread it, pump it, or pour it, then it is subject to the 3.4 ounce rule. Now, if you want to read all of the other seven tips the TSA gives, I will email them out to you tonight in my News Girl News Roundup email, so make sure you sign yourself up.